this video is going to go over showing you how to build cube maps with this new script I've just created. Um, it's very simple. It takes screenshots and moves cameras and rotates them. And the camera has a field of view of 90 to get it perfectly square and make all the edges line up. So I'm going to hit O on the keyboard. It's going to go through all my positions I've set up in Unity. And it's going to generate screenshots for me. Just like that. And we should have 12 because there's two positions and there's six images per side per cube map because a cube has six sides and we do have 12 images right there so I'm going to start up unity I'm going to import these in I already have one out there but we're not going to look at that right now let's just hide it for now I don't know why I'm getting some errors right now. I just had a little crash in Unity and it's not having fun. So I'm going to delete these old cube maps. I'm going to imp I'm going to create a new one, sorry. And I'm going to drag in these six images. And these will create our cube map that we these just came out of the screenshot. These are the screenshots directly from Unity. So there's no trickery here or anything. Now the reason why I created this is that Unity is lacking um, in a few features, like generating QMaps without the need for the Pro version, which I think is stupid, because QMaps are so handy that they save on resources and all that. Okay, so we have a cube map created, and I'm going to drag it to my new material, and we're going to go outside to the skybox and take a look at it. And there it is. And as you see, there's no seams, which is what you'd expect from a skybox and a cube map. So the cube map it generated was perfect. Now, how does this work? Well, we have a camera, field of view set to 90, and we have a generate cube map script attached to it. And it has a positions array, which basically I place cubes around the level. As you can see I have two right here and that's where the uh, cube maps were generated from. One there and one there. The name hallway stairs goes into the file name that it generates. So I'm going to add another array or another element to this array. And I'm going to generate a new object. I'm going to name this one cube3 and I'm going to drag cube3 onto the third element there okay good I had a weird crash with unity and it wouldn't copy the temp folder over so that's why I just checked the task manager um, okay so now we just set up another cube which is our position we're going to feed that into my script and we're going to take a screenshot from that position. So I'm going to build this and we're going to get to test it right away. Okay, start it up and then I'll hit O on the keyboard and we'll start generating cube maps. It should be more than 12 this time. as you can see the last image is different as it should be these are named cube so we do have new images for our cube map and it's pretty simple to set up very simple to use um, saves you hours of work and uh, I'll be uploading this script pretty soon I hope you enjoy